Once you face your fear, nothing is ever as hard as you think. I live every day to its fullest extent and I don't sweat the small stuff. Let me hear your body talk. I look at my cancer journey as a gift. It made me slow down and realize that the important things in life and taught me to not sweat the small stuff. Fight each round take it on the chin. And never 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 ever give in. I believe love is what makes the world go round. No matter how old or young, love is why we are here. It is the very essence of one's being. I love you. I honestly love you. I don't know what my path is yet. I'm just walking on it. I do have high standards, but I don't expect anything from anyone that I don't expect from myself. I love animals. They give so much to you and demand so little. And you can trust them. Family, nature and health all go together. Nature is the most beautiful thing we have. It's better than art because it's from the creator. Cancer got me over unimportant fears, like getting old. I want to get physical, let's get into physical, let me hear your body talk, your body talk. Breast cancer is not necessarily a death sentence, stay strong and centered and be involved in all aspects of your treatment. I took you to an intimate restaurant, then to a suggestive movie. There's nothing left to talk about, unless it's horizontally. To be loved is the most basic of human needs, like a flower. It waters the human soul. But to love is a true blessing. My cancer scare changed my life. I'm grateful for every new, healthy day I have. It has helped me prioritize my life. I love life and nothing intimidates me anymore. I live my life in gratitude. My memories are inside me, they're not things or a place, I can take them anywhere. There's a rumor going around that I miss Goody Two Shoes from Australia. Well, that's a laugh. I'm really miss Goody Two Shoes from England. As for highlights, of course Greece changed my life and I will always be grateful for that experience. I have had someone wonderful things happen to me during my career and lifetime. Of course, personally, the birth of my daughter is the highlight of my life. There's a balance in my life, there's reality and there's the part that looks really glamorous, but we're all just people in the end. Live, love. Knowing that we're all free now that we are blessed in our country and realize how lucky we are. I love that quiet time when nobody's up and the animals are all happy to see me. I feel so fortunate and grateful to be a survivor of breast cancer. I see it as a gift. The only weights I lift are my dogs. My wish is that all women age 20 and above perform monthly breast self-examinations. I'm happy, and I think being happy keeps you looking young. I simply have a marvelous life, a very lucky life. 
I love to make stories out of license plates on cars about the initials and the numbers, my mum used to do that with me. We women should remember that we are much more than just breasts. To me luxury is to be at home with my daughter, and the occasional massage doesn't hurt. Nothing I have done professionally will top the feeling I got when singing with John Farnham at the 2000 Olympic Games in Sydney. I have really been blessed in my career with some wonderful songwriters and in turn, songs. It's very hard to get good songs because a lot of writers record their own, they keep the best for themselves. I love clothes. I don't know a woman who doesn't. But generally women are intrigued with fashion. Designers are almost making fun of us at times. I really love performing with an orchestra and am very excited to do so with the Kalamazoo Symphony.